starting it like that. Hey guys, welcome back to Pork Chats with the Magruders. This is season two, and obviously we're not on a porch if you're watching the video. Um, we will be inside for the future. For the future of the videos. <laughs> yeah. They will all be inside. They will not be outside, because <laughs> that's so unpredictable and difficult. <laughs> well, and we really love the concept, but... Because we live in an apartment, it makes it really challenging with all of the outdoor noises. So that will And we not don't be have a big porch, so thing. it's also really crammed. And in the middle of the parking lot, so everybody's just like, if they walk by, they're like, what are they doing up there? And then I get super awkward every time someone walks past. She's like, all right, pause real quick. I'm like, wait. <laughs> don't, <laughs> don't let them see us. <laughs> don't breathe. <laughs> but we like the concept because the, the whole point is that we want to have conversations that we would have with our friends on the porch or in the living room or whatever it is, just welcoming you, the listener or viewer into our home to have conversations about um, whatever we have. <laughs> <laughs> whatever it is that we're talking to you about. Yeah. No, but yeah, that really is the idea because originally, obviously we took a slight break. So there is a very large gap between the first season and, the and this season. Um, the last time we were making episodes was probably in September. I think Marcus said before we started this, I've asked him about five times if it was September, yeah, it was but September, I, think. I think it was September. Um, so anyways, but we kind of had this idea. We were like, maybe we're going to just completely rebrand. And then we were like, no, we don't want to do that because of the concept of porch chats. We do it's, like it. We yeah. really like it because it's not just centered, like Marcus said, around our porch. It's more like we do want to create an atmosphere on this podcast that is going to be like, if we're just sitting down and talking to you yep. um, and we're just talking about things we care about, talking about life, and it would be something we would talk to you about if you were here. So yeah. we wanted to stick with that concept. Absolutely. Yeah. And I think, too, it, it's like, w you know, our friends bring things to us as well. Like la the first season, we just answered comments. That's all it was, yeah. was like each episode was like responding to something that somebody said or asked us and I think that's also still the concept is just like talking about what you guys care about what we care about and what's important and just topics that are on our hearts or are on your hearts that um that we want to provide some encouragement in or some sort of yeah input on that yeah and I think for us too like just um, this is kind of like our vision slash like welcome back episode but yeah um just so you guys kind of understand our hearts with it um I think we we have a real desire and always have to make our social medias and particularly just our mission on social media to like keep the Lord present within whatever we're doing mm -hmm. whether it's that every single episode is super centered in some really deep theological topic or whether it's genuinely just us kind of like talking about life and talking about obviously the ways that the Lord shapes every corner of what we do and yeah, who absolutely. we are and because we know as believers as a young married couple as young parents but also just as people like our ultimate desire is to make Christ known in what we're doing. Yeah. And if you're watching this, we hope that you either have questions about Jesus or that you're seeking to follow him or that maybe you want to. So <laughs> we really want to provide yeah. a space that is casual, but also yeah. formal in the sense of we take seriously like the name of the Lord and we want to make sure Absolutely. that we are honoring him in what we're doing. And so that is kind of why we've decided to just focus on this podcast and not try to be so <laughs> everywhere in every avenue. But mm -hmm. yeah, I don't know, babe, what would and, you say and about that? And moving forward, I mean, like we've over the last two or three years or whatever, we've taken many different like routes with social media. Um, and this is moving forward what we want to do um, and what we feel most just motivated to do um and also it's what's most feasible for us um because you know vlogging is great but we have a lot going on and yeah. kids and like that just doesn't make sense all the time so what makes sense is recording podcasts during naps and um releasing and shorter episodes and yeah so this next season will be shorter episodes um on a daily basis so I think actually the first season, our episodes were around the same range of time. as Yeah, I it's be. not, we're not trying to pitch a completely different like, idea. Yeah, no. 
just a little bit more revised in the way that we're going about it also. Yeah, absolutely. And also a focus more on it um, because last time we were doing, you know, this type of video a week and then a vlog and then another type of video and this will be just every day you get a podcast and you can listen to it. You can watch it on YouTube or you can watch the clips of it on um, all of the social medias, yeah. um, which that would actually be great to follow our Porch Chats social medias. They'll be um, linked in the bio. I don't, we haven't even created them. If you're, if you're on YouTube or if you're on Spotify or whatever, um, follow the, follow the podcast. I don't, I guess follow or subscribe, subscribe, whatever it is and give it a rating and just, you know, tell your friends about it. We're, we want to connect with as many people as possible, but also we love the community that we had in season one and hopefully we'll reestablish in season two. Yeah. And I think also just to like be transparent with you guys, I think, you know, for a season we were really trying to be like all in on social media. Mm -hmm. And that was what Marcus was talking about too, with like having, trying to have like multiple videos Right. And having multiple style videos. And I think we honestly just, <laughs> we just bit off a lot more than we could, tr we could chew. Um, because we were going through a lot of transitional periods as a family. We yeah. moved around that time. Then we found out we were pregnant again. And I have had a pretty similar pregnancy with this one as far as sickness goes. So it's just been a lot on us <laughs> yeah. to try to like approach it the way that we were approaching it and I don't necessarily think that I think we had the right heart behind it the whole time but I think we were trying to do too many types of things mm -hmm. and for us when we even look at our own personal like Instagrams and stuff and what feels natural to us a podcast is what aligns with that and right. we don't want to feel like we have to try to create every avenue of content when that's just not who we are as people um and, and we don't have capacity for it filming throughout the day as well is tougher um now you know at the beginning <coughs> we either didn't have kids or we had a little baby and that's totally different than having a toddler pretty much around. a toddler <laughs> yeah because weston has gone from crawling to sprinting <laughs> pretty yes pretty like much. in the course of a week <laughs> he took his first steps a few days before his birthday and he has yeah. not looked back crawling is not him anymore he's no crawling. I uh, I put him down in t uh, Target earlier. No, yeah, Target. Yeah. And he was at the end of the aisle in like a split second. He was just running and like, Mom? Mm, mama, like mama. Yeah. He's but. crazy. But yeah, so that being said, it is, it's totally different. Yeah, and to for try you to, to chase him around and yeah. try and film. and But also. And we're almost about to be in newborn life plus that. Yep. So this is so feasible and it's. Also really enjoyable or for the us. the most feasible. Yeah, the most feasible. Yeah. So feasible might be a little bit. Yeah, <laughs> I don't know how. But it we'll is going to be a lot easier. And we have a lot more structure going into it this time. Yeah. And we also have, like, really been encouraged by the feedback you guys have given us from, like, the first episodes. Um, mm -hmm. Especially because when we say, like, our heart genuinely aligns so much more with kind of, like, podcast style type of content. Yeah. Um, we really mean that. So I think it's been really encouraging for us to even see, like, you guys have gone back and listened to our episodes even when we haven't been posting, which there is just... There was a spike in December randomly. Yes, which is wild. It, uh, yeah. I was getting, like, notifications and stuff, and I get, like, a weekly email of where the podcast is, like, charting on, yeah. like, <coughs> Spotify and Apple Podcasts. That was podcasts. so wild to me. And it was not charting for a long time, yeah. from September to December, because we didn't post any podcasts. Yeah. And then in December, randomly, it jumped... And, like, more people were listening to it for some reason, and it jumped into the top ten. And I don't know how or why, but um, <laughs> We had a good laugh about that. it. Yeah. We were like, we were like, of course, we're not even doing anything. But yeah. I think, yeah, and for you guys to know from us, too, because our desire is not to be inconsistent. We actually both really hate inconsistency. Mm -hmm. And even for us, like, that's why another reason why we were like, let's just focus on this because we can be consistent with it yeah. and we can feasibly give you guys content that is like, yeah, consistent that you can count on. And we yeah. want to be that. And we want it to be something we're passionate about at the same time, not something that feels like, oh my gosh, I'm just so overwhelmed. I don't want to do this. And mm -hmm. when we sit down to do this, <coughs> we really do want to do it. And yeah. also, yeah, we have less pressure on it now because we're just in a better 
season, honestly. I yeah. think f- for our family, we've just kind of, I don't know. Yeah. So structure wise, though, a couple of things with that is we are going to have a baby in about a month. So we will be taking a break. There will, I think we'll film ahead a little bit. And so you'll probably see videos or, or podcasts while we're, you know, while we have a newborn that we're just scheduled to go up. Um, we're not going to, I think we'll probably take at least a month off of like actually filming because Taylor will have to recover. The baby will have to kind of, or we will have to get um, adjusted yeah, to for sure. two babies. Yeah. Um, so yeah, but we don't want it to be like this massive halt. It could yeah, be so that the episodes are a little more spread so out. So well, yeah, they may be a little bit more spread out, or um, there may be like a little break in like between season two and three, maybe. Um, but we'll see. I just, but just know that if it seems like, oh well, why is she still pregnant in the podcast? But like she was due like a, a week ago. We I had probably the had the baby. Yeah. <laughs> we just we just wanted to film <coughs> and get ahead because we really do like our vision is to be. Yeah. Very consistent. So Absolutely. we're really excited about it. Um, and just kind of moving forward, we, yeah, like like you said, we want our topics to be, you know, we're going to talk about the Lord. We're going to talk about family and, I mean, marriage and relationship and parenting and all that is what's going on in our lives. And it's what's on our minds. Um, but if you have something on your mind um, and you would like to hear about it or even just, you know, talk about it as if we were on the porch yeah. then let us know comment or dm us or whatever yeah. that may be well and i think for us too like we don't obviously like parenting and marriage and like family like super huge like marcus said like very yeah. much what's going on in our life but there's also a million things that play into that yeah, and absolutely. a million things going on even in our spiritual walk and things that we're learning from the lord concepts we're wrestling with sin we're wrestling with like right. the, a lot of things so we don't have to exclusively talk about like our relationship or our relationship with our kids. Mm -hmm. And I think that's our hope too, is like, we don't want to make this just like a place where like parents and married couples come to watch us. Not that we don't want that, but I think, I don't know, just creating like really, I don't know, inclusive, I guess, just like environment where we're talking about things that are relevant for, yeah, for everyone in every stage, not just the people who are married and have young kids. Absolutely. And there, I mean, so I've worked in a in a job for years that, or mul- different jobs f- over the course of the last however many years that um I listen to a lot of podcasts because I'm doing a lot more than me. Yes, <laughs> I listen to like three because <laughs> <laughs> I'm doing like labor of some sort that I don't necessarily need. Like I'm not talking to somebody all the time, so sometimes I'll be listening to a podcast a lot of times. Um, and there are lots of different ones that I listen to, but um. They don't, and they don't all have to, they're not all, you know, 20 year old dads talking about their experience. It's all sorts of different things. So we want it to be an environment and a place that you come on a daily, weekly basis, whatever it is, um, where you can connect with us, but then also the topics that we're talking about. So, um, that's our goal for it. That's kind of our, our vision. We're really excited. Yeah. And we also have like other things along the way that like, we really are like we're dreaming big for this and Absolutely. hoping big things for this, but also like holding it loosely and really entrusting it to the Lord. I feel like just to be honest with you guys, last time we we just like really wanted it to work, which I don't think is bad. But I do think that yeah. we kind of had we put some pressure on it and on all the things we were trying to do. Yeah. Um. So I think this time, honestly, just we're both going into it. We feel, I think more light about it and excited because yeah. we're hopeful for the vision and kind of the fresh eyes that the Lord has given us just to be right. faithful with something and do it well. Yeah. Um, so yeah, Absolutely. we're really excited. Um, moving forward <laughs> further, <laughs> um, moving forward further, we would love to, um, connect on a deeper level with our community and, um, Eventually, we would like to do, like, some sort of Bible study and... Don't spoil it. I'm not spoiling anything. <laughs> and and have, well, we will have different <laughs> things there. I think yeah. I would love to have, like, a hat or a sweatshirt or something. Um, and just r- different things that can, like, make the community more of a tangible thing. Um, but the best way that you can um, help us to realize that who the community is of people who care about it and want to 
be a part of that type of thing is yeah. to to let us know and to and interact, interact with us. Yeah. Um, <coughs> yeah. So and we love, like, we read every comment. We yeah. really do. Like, we want we want to see that it is building you guys up. And obviously, we can take feedback, too, if there's something that you want to see different or yeah. whatever. Like, we're really open, <coughs> open to it's that. It's interesting because, some, I mean, there are some creators who are massive who, hey, if this gets to however many comments or, hey, like this so that it gets to this or whatever. And a lot of that, like, yes, it helps the algorithm. It helps it boost it to uh, different people. That's great. Yes, we want that, too. But... At the same time, we're small enough to where we do read every comment. So <laughs> yeah. just interact to interact with us. Like, it's not necessarily like, hey, let's get this as many comments as possible. So, you know, 20,000 people see it or like it. Exactly. Or yeah, well, and our, that's great, never really been our goal. Like, not that we don't want. Like, we do. We hope this reaches people. We hope that yep. this can encourage as many people as possible. But also, it's more like quality of even community for us, like yep. over the quantity. And... um. Well, and I think just a reminder, too, of, like, we also are really trying to balance, like, and I think this is important to say, just because I feel this sometimes, like, with my Instagram, like, it's really important to balance for us, like, the community we've cultivated online, and um, we really want to balance cultivating a community online, but also for us, like, really wanting to still cultivate, obviously, the people we have immediately in front of us in our lives, because yeah. we do have a church community, and we're seeking Absolutely. to be a part of our small group and be immediately present with those people also. And in some ways like that will be more of a priority. I don't know if that makes sense, and but I just felt led to share that. A little we want to encourage that to be your priority as well. So like, yes. And yes, this, we're not going to have all the answers. No, we know that you don't <laughs> no. assume that we have all the answers, but just to say that we don't have all the answers. We don't know you super personally. Uh, not everybody, at least. And we can't replace biblical accountability nor biblical training in your life by your local church ever Absolutely. for any reason. So, <laughs> yeah. So we would love to interact with you on a daily basis through this podcast. Yeah. But we hope that it encourages you to have a relationship not only with Christ, but with your local church community as well. Yeah. Um, and that's our vision for Four Chats Season 2. Yeah. And we're so excited. We really are and yeah. feel just motivated and, yeah, excited to jump back into this with you guys. So if you're excited about it and if you want to be a part of it, we would love for you to um, yeah, subscribe and follow. and Yes, leave a comment maybe yeah. about some topics you would like to hear Absolutely. in the next um, episodes to come. Obviously, we'll be kind of posting these and we'll already have some recorded and ready for you guys. But we'll get to them. But we will get to them. So. Yeah. Okay. Thanks for your patience, everybody. <laughs> yeah. um, if, Thank yeah, you if for you your support. If you came back from season one, <laughs> comment that. Because your commitment is we appreciate astounding. You. Yeah. <laughs> um, yeah, you've been more, commi more committed more than committed us. More committed than us. And we know that. And we thank you for your consistency. <laughs> but um, we're figuring it out. So we don't know how we're going to start or finish the episodes. But we'll see you tomorrow. See you tomorrow.